What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. Hope you're doing well, feeling great and enjoying freedom. It's a great day to have a great day. Today I want to talk about and review the Cabela's Mountain Trapper Zero Degree Rectangle Sleeping Bag. We're going to get into it, but really quick, just in case you're new, make sure to subscribe for a bunch of videos. Subscribe to my second channel for bonus videos. Get yourself some DYDSS merchandise to help support the channel. Try out some G Fuel Energy Formula, $5 off your first order by clicking the link in the description. And of course, make sure to go and get your up to 12 free fractional shares by downloading Weeble and funding your account. Every month they have a new promo going on, whether it be bonus stocks for referrals or whether it be referring three friends and getting a spin wheel spin where you can get all the way up to $1,000 worth of free Apple stock. There's always a new promo going on. We will link in the description. Everything is linked in the description. All right, so today I wanna to talk about this Cabela's Mountain Trapper sleeping bag. It's a heavy duty, super solid sleeping bag. And I'm actually gonna be taking it over here and giving it a little bit of a review. And I'm gonna show you what this thing is all about. And before I do that, let me also just issue a friendly reminder that I always include links to camping and prepping equipment and whatnot if anybody's interested in portable power stations or water purification units or emergency hand crank radios and just just things like that things that I personally believe make absolute perfect sense for camping and or prepping a lot of the time they go hand in hand all those links will be in the description this is something that you can get on the Cabela's website I do not have a link it's just on the site. So this right here, unbuckle the three spots and you can roll this thing out. This thing is absolutely insane. I'm a massive fan already. Now this review is going to be somewhat of a part one. This review is going to be more of a first impression than anything else. And that's because I have not used this just yet. This right here is something that I got for winter camping slash winter car camping. I wanna see what it's like to car camp in the coldest months of the year, January, February of the new year. As I'm filming this video, it's the end of July. As it's coming out, it's the beginning of August so it's pretty much the hottest time of the year. I don't even wanna be making this review right here. I don't even wanna think about this thing. I don't even wanna look at this thing. I'm sweating just being around it. <laughs> but I wanted to give everybody a nice look of what we're working with right here. This is something that I got on the actual website. This thing's like, I believe it's $130. I got it at a discounted price. Now, I do not work with Cabela's. They were not the ones that gave me the discount. I bought this on a separate website. And the cool thing about this particular sleeping bag, after I went through a whole list of potential sleeping bags that I wanted to get, I chose to go with this one because number one, I'm very, very familiar with the Cabela's brand. Two, this thing looks like it would be absolutely perfect and would really come in handy for what I would be using it for. And three, it has so many features to it. I mean, right off the bat, let's talk about the canvas. Let's talk about this right here. Unfortunately, you can't feel it through a video, but it's a pretty rugged, but also still comfortable. Like it's, it doesn't feel like you're inside of one of those like paper bags for leaves. It, it doesn't feel like that at all. It doesn't feel like crunchy or anything like that. It's actually really soft, but it's also hardcore. It's this heavyweight cotton canvas shell with a water repellent finish to it. So this isn't something that I'm going to be necessarily camping outdoors with. This is something that I got myself as a car camping supply. And the reason I got it was just because I figured it would 
come in handy in the winter time and and uh, I haven't car camped in, in the, the coldest winter months of the year so that's something that I'm gonna be giving a try and I'm gonna be giving it a try with this right here so I got it uh, obviously like half a year in advance but an opportunity presented itself to get it for a couple dollars cheaper so uh, I picked one up now as for the inside we already talked about the outside we talked about the heavyweight hardcore cotton canvas shell with the water repellent finish what about the inside right here check this out right here this is potentially the softest material I've ever felt in my life and like I said before I'm sweating just looking at this thing but I know for an absolute fact this thing is going to be perfect December January February this thing is going to be an absolute lifesaver so it has this soft warm brushed cotton flannel lining on the inside it's like padded right here or stuffed right here super thick this is the part that would go like right around uh i guess your neck area neck chest area keep you extra warm it zips all the way up and it's lightweight which is cool about this thing i mean i mean the entire product i mean it weighs a couple of pounds so this isn't something that you're gonna like you're not going to be hiking around with this thing it's probably a little bit too big bulky and heavy for that but at the same time it's lightweight it's something that you could toss in the the, the back seat of the car it's something that you can toss in the bed of the truck or or, or, or if you're you know cargo van camping or, or if you're just driving somewhere and setting up a tent and just tossing it inside that's what this is for this right here is not for taking on a hiking trail a little bit too big and bulky for that but it's this lightweight 100% polyester insulation comfort rated down to zero degrees Fahrenheit that right there was the selling point for me I wanted something heavy duty I wanted something that I could take into the coldest of the coldest winter months and car camp not in this big fancy RV not in a cabin a car or a tent exposed to the elements that's what I wanted a sleeping bag for and there were so many different options that I could have went with I chose to go with this one right here for you know the, the the list that I'm currently in the process of going down the insulated five inch wraparound chest baffle and three inch insulated zipper baffles attached stuff flap I'm, I'm reading on the list right now attached stuff flap ensures hassle-free transport and storage two-way YKK zippers with anti-snag webbed zipper guards and reversible locking zipper pulls attached stuff flap with three heavy-duty two-inch nylon web straps and quick release buckles that's you know what I showed you before when I opened up this whole thing inner pocket oh that's another one I forgot about something that to be honest with you I'm probably not gonna be using but this right here this velcro pocket I don't know if I could do it with one hand there we go pocket right there so like that it's a pocket right there at the top for you for I guess whatever you might need your phone a snack who knows and as for the specs, this thing is 84 inches long. So this is pretty rock solid. If you're on the taller end, on the shorter end, should be good. 36 inches wide. Depending on the size of people camping, you might even be able to fit two people in here. That's how wide this thing is. Now, I wouldn't recommend it, but this thing is friggin' wide. This thing is friggin' long. This thing is the real deal as far as I'm concerned, and I can't wait to actually give it a try, and this is just my first impression. I can't wait to give it a proper review. I can't wait to actually take this thing out and test it out for myself and use it in the coldest of the cold winter months of the year. Give a little bit of a testimonial. Uh, the carry weight, by the way, is about eight to ten pounds the site says ten pounds and and some of the review videos that I've watched prior to making the purchase people said it was eight pounds 
but the website says 10 pounds, so I'm just gonna go ahead and assume that it's 10 pounds. Comfort rating, once again, zero degrees Fahrenheit. So that's pretty much all I have to say about this right here. This is the first impression, my first impression of the Cabela's Mountain Trapper Zero Degree Sleeping Bag. I'm so friggin' excited. This thing feels incredible. This thing looks incredible. How does it perform? How does it hold up in the months of December, January, February, maybe early March? I guess we'll find out, because I will absolutely be giving this a try. I will absolutely be giving this a test, the ultimate test, and I will make a follow-up video, and it will be posted right here on the channel. But I want you guys to head on down to the comments and let me know anything and everything related to today's video topic. When it comes to car camping, or when it comes to camping in general, what type of sleeping bag do you use? And if you're somebody that's looking for a sleeping bag, is this something that you could see yourself purchasing? After carefully considering maybe five or six different sleeping bags, I mean, there, there's, there are a million different sleeping bags out there. I narrowed it down to about five or six that I could have absolutely saw myself purchasing. There goes my alarm. I could have absolutely saw myself purchasing any of the ones that I, I narrowed it down to, but this is the one that I felt as though I had uh, uh, the most upside. This is the one that made the most sense for what I'm personally going to be using it for. There are other sleeping bags out there that are better for other reasons. Reasons that I don't really necessarily think that I would need to get that type of sleeping bag for. But for what I'm going to be using it for, I personally believe this was the best possible option. So head on down to the comments and let me know anything and everything related to today's video topic. If you guys like today's video please hit that like button subscribe if you're new subscribe to my second channel which is my backup channel for exclusive weekly content get yourself some DYDSS merchandise to help support the channel try out some G Fuel energy formula five dollars off your first order by clicking the link in the description sugar-free low calorie packed with a whole bunch of vitamins over 50 different flavors to choose from this one is Miami Nights it's like a pina colada flavor it's my favorite flavor that they've come out with and it's perfect for the summer so five dollars off your first order by clicking the link in the description and then of course absolutely last but not least Make sure to go and get your up to 12 free fractional shares by downloading Weeble and funding your account. You can deposit as little as you'd like, even as little as a penny. It still works, still counts. You still get your up to 12 free fractional shares. And every month they have a new promo going on. I'm filming this in July. I don't know what the August promo is going to be, but sometimes it's bonus stocks for referrals. Sometimes if you refer three friends, they're going to give you up to $1,000 a free Apple stock. There's always something like that going on. There's always a perk. There's always something awesome. There's always some way that gives us even more. It's part of their advertising budget. So we will link in the description. Everything is linked in the description. Just like I said before, a bunch of other supplies other than this sleeping bag right here. You can go to the website and, 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 and buy it if that's what you want. But I have a bunch of Amazon affiliate links. If anybody's interested in portable power stations, water purification units, emergency hand crank radios, things like that. Things that make sense for somebody who doesn't even go camping. Just prepping supplies. Prepping supplies and camping supplies are oftentimes synonymous. So if you're interested in any of the supplies, there are way more than that. There's a whole long list of supplies that I leave linked in the description. Amazon affiliate links in case anybody just wants to click on them and read the reviews, check out what they look like, the descriptions, or if you want to buy them for yourself, you can absolutely do so as well for no additional cost. I want you guys to head on down to the comments and let me know anything and everything related to today's video topic. What type of sleeping bag do you use? Is this something that you think is going to be ideal for the cold winter months? The Cabela Mountain Trapper Zero Degree Sleeping Bag. Let me know anything and everything related to today's video topic in the comment section down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you next time. Don't you dare stop smiling. Peace.